Hey hi hello welcome back to my new video this is Sampath you are watching Sampath Samfx YouTube channel and this is Xiaomi Mi 11X 5G or the Poco F3 or the Redmi K40 custom ROM reviews back with Xiaomi HyperOS guys version 1.0.24.1.22 developer now you guys can see detailed info and specs you guys can see here or the version of Android is still 14 here and kernel usage is 4.19.157 power of kernel has been used security patch is 2024 11 i mean january 6 gb of ram is there and virtual 6 gb has been added in this particular rom and i made already video on this particular rom i will just look out this uh, change logs whatever we got here let me show that yeah this all the change logs what we can see now this is the 24.1.22 uh, you also get this is switch back to modern i mean k60 now Improved smoothness, you can see fixed initial crash. For previous version, there was some initial crash. I even uh, flashed some file, but here that is not the problem. And added an optional to enable rounded controls and restraints. We'll check out that. Added app vault mod by because improved the iOS status bar theme. Added shortcuts for themes and app vault. Switch to latest Orange Fox recovery. Now you can flash this using Orange Fox recovery also and will show some benchmark results guys and uh, this edit section people were asking as you can see you can do like this 182 now select this this i version shown in the previous version as you can see like this you can do and this is live wallpaper guys there is an animation everywhere even in settings if i close as you can see even file manager there are some animations as you can see and this one i am using but nothing is working here the widgets are printed here and this is typical home screen and the app drawer what we get the weather application is also a little bit improved now as you can see this is all the stats you get in the weather and you actually see this and air quality index result also you can see here which is quite good here and security application is also a little bit revamped here as you can see this is new hyper os security application now you also get this change scanning UI stack UI if you want you can enable that enable fraud features if you want that you can do that unlock audio features or uh, some of the like dolby feature as yes, subtitle style features you can do that from here really i like this uh, new security features let's unlock dolby feature yeah game turbo again you can add the games from here that's cool and some results will show first yeah these are the results we'll go to gallery why we yeah where is the gallery application here no gallery has been removed in this particular row anyhow we'll show from here now this is the safety status guys as you can see basic integrity and cities profile match gets past here no need to worry and these are the read rate speeds with numericals and graph and this is the single score and multi score performance of geekbench on this particular rom for me 11 x android version is 14 again this is 103 test case since the app was installed i can able to do that and again i did a dirty flash method you can also use the same thing uh, if you are in previous version, if you are in some other customer, you need to flash clean flash method. You should use that. Maximum scores you guys can see 314, average 299, minimum is 279, and it's to 90% of its max performance. The performance of this UI is really stable here. And if I can show you, this was with uh, performance mode enabled actually. This is the score what I got, and this is without performance mode enabled yeah that's the score what i got and this is the version and this is 33 watt charging support and charging rapidly also you can see nothing change has been improved here and camera again you get all the settings like 4k 60 fps option is not available as of now and settings mode you get all these options here picture quality up to uh, super is available by default it will behave make it super here the ui is really really smooth now compared to previous version and also you get nfc for poco f3 devices but xiaomi mi linux we don't get that and this rounded corners and all we'll check that and this is the aqua battery results what why i got 
using this particular ROM now and we'll go into settings and check out this hyper os customization here rounded tiles rotate the device once to apply yeah we need to rotate okay now rounded tiles rotate the device once to apply this side Anyhow, I have rotated. That's how it looks like. Extended power menu again. This is there for previous build also. You can directly boot into recovery and fast boot mode from here. I was like of dynamic island again. We'll show that also. As you can see, now it's been improved a lot compared to previous version. As you can see. That's fine and max FPS in all apps force it that and iOS status bar here. Uh, you need to actually, yeah, this one apply mm, super icons. It says it's getting applied here, it's pre installed actually. No, cancel. Yeah, now you guys can see here status bar style has been changed now. It's kind of iOS super icons has been applied, but if you want to use any other, then you can use that too. And limitless classic is pre-installed here extra dim features and all what i can say is this is best rom available already but they have improved a little bit compared to previous version and they come back with k60 port now and i was also not showing this before uh, security privacy and security you guys can see these are the privacy features you get once you go into security again these are the things you get some are region specific you should look out them notification status bar again everything remains same i already explained in the previous video here if you want you can do the, the battery life is little bit uh, worrying here compared to previous version but overall it's a good rom i can say and in the additional settings you get plenty of options here as you can see tapless floating windows memory extension additional app features again these things remain same and quick settings toggles are also a uh, little bit revamped here are looking better in my opinion here and definitely you should uh, go and upgrade this particular room no problem as of now i have faced in this particular room uh, we'll do one thing show the bgm and wind up this video and what are the graphics settings we get in this particular room let's see and as i said before you will get that graphic settings up to 90 fps here even ultra stair options are also given i recommend to play with smooth plus 90 only if you want smooth gameplay and if you are a creator and all you can go with ultra hd uh, you also get this gaming mode here as i shown before also you can actually make bright and saturated here enhanced visuals also you can enable here smart frame rate and super resolution and this performance mode has been enabled by default once you open the game and voice changer features are going to work here yeah that's fine and let's see how it actually handles here in this particular room is it any change or really good the performance let's check out this and if you first time to this channel hit that subscribe button down below this and also like the bell notification by pressing the bell icon and if you like the video give it a like The gameplay is fine here. You can also see the real time FPS count here. But for some reason, it is showing only 60 here. But we have enabled 90 FPS option here. Let's see. I can't say exactly it's in 90 or 60 here, but the gameplay is smooth. I'll do one thing i'll come back here this is the bgmi gameplay and quickly show you the fingerprint unlock speeds and even the face unlock speeds here as you can see let's get unlocked and this lock screen customizations everything if you can check out my previous videos 
you can check out that this version of previous video also you can check out i will be giving the link in the description also in the i section check out that video for features and all this is just a change log and uh, kind of a review kind of thing here and you guys can see now it is a little bit curved rotated now the quick settings toggle everything is working fine here i haven't faced any issues as of now and this is kind of recent style is also looking good here uh, if you're still not subscribed to my youtube channel hit that subscribe button guys we'll meet you with another interesting video until that keep smiling bye bye for now